What's going on guys, it's Brayden back here again today for another BFR. About time to get back into these because I just had no time. I quite literally worked three full days, like 12 hour shifts, three straight days. But uh, game 54 versus the Pittsburgh Penguins is a 7.30 game on February 15th. This was now the two games ago. Um, the score ends up being 4-1 for Pittsburgh. The uh, Hawks dropped to 14, 37, and 3. Bedard had returned, surprisingly, he had been announced that he would return earlier that morning, and um, he was wearing the bubble mask, so that was cool. Kachuk was in, Reese Johnson and Pitlick were out, Pitlick had been waived as well. Shots were 29-25, Chicago, hits were 14-8, Chicago, Pittsburgh had led them face-offs, however, 30-17. Power play, Chicago goes 0-2, Pittsburgh 0-1, no Getzel, Achari, or Harkins in the lineup for Pittsburgh, Getzel being the big name there. Uh, Soderblom saves 22 out of 25. Nedeljkovic saves 28 out of 29. Uh, first period. Uh, the first shot goes in for Pittsburgh, and who else but Sidney Crosby? It's a redirect. It's 29th of the season from Pedersen and Raquel to make it 1-0. Blackwell is then robbed. Ra Raquel is denied. Uh, 7-20. Pittsburgh scores again. It's a backhand goal by Riley Smith, the former Golden Knight. 10th of the season from O'Connor to make it 2-0. Uh, Radish to Kachuk, 2-on-1, falters, 56 seconds to go, Chicago penalty to Magna for tripping, which would be killed. Second period, Jeff Carter has a chance that's saved. 11:38, Chicago, one-timer goal, it's Philip Kershev off a turnover, his ninth of the season from Bedard, he's back, from Foligno to make it 2-1. Bedard reclaims the rookie scoring lead after not having it for about a day, um, and being off for about a month. Crosby backhand hits the post, um... Then there was a scrum, and then there was a bad hand pass call that kind of screwed the Hawks over. 522 is a Pittsburgh penalty to White for cross-checking, which would be killed. Um, Pittsburgh has full control. Uh, missed trip on Graves, and we go to the third. Uh, 1409, Pittsburgh scores. It's an open net goal, essentially, for Sidney Crosby. Uh, 30th of the season for Merkel and Pedersen once again to make it 3-1. to 99th career multi-goal game for Crosby. Obviously one of the all-time greats, and probably the greatest of my generation. Um, 120, Pittsburgh penalty to Raquel for holding, which would be killed. Dickinson was hurt. He had no pressure on his right side, but he would play. Uh, 50 seconds to go then, but I eventually changed it to 49.7. It's a Pittsburgh empty net shorthanded goal to Brian Rust with his 15th of the season unassisted to make it 4-1. The Hawks had pulled the goalie to make it 6-4 at 120. But that is going to be all I have for you guys in this one. I still have the Ottawa game to do next. Both of these will be posted consecutively. And then, of course... I will be doing the BFR for the Carolina Hurricanes uh, in Car game, game in Carolina uh, tomorrow. But yeah, that's going to be all I have for you guys in this one. I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I shall see you guys in the next one. Have a good one.